In this lesson, I will teach you how you can create a perfect development environment for Laravel applications using Homestead. This is the recommended way to develop Laravel applications. Please read more about Homestead in laravel.com. You can also choose Exam or MAMP if you like. I'm going to set up Homestead in my Mac. First, I will need to download VirtualBox and Vagrant to use Homestead. Let's download VirtualBox. Choose your operating system and install it. Let's also download Vagrant and follow the same installation process. Now that we have successfully installed both VirtualBox and Vagrant, the next step is actually installing Homestead. Homestead includes all the softwares we need to develop Laravel applications. Open up your terminal and run this command Vagrant Box add Laravel Homestead. Here you get two options. I choose one to use VirtualBox. Once the Homestead box has been added for VirtualBox, you need to create a folder in your Mac. This box will contain Homestead as well as all your sites that you will be creating in future. I'm creating this folder in my home directory, which is Ryan Dungill. Now get inside web folder and install Homestead by cloning its repository using the following command. If your Mac is new, you might get a message to install Xcode first. In that case, please do install it first. Now run the bash init command to create homestead.yaml file. This will create our configuration file. You will see the message homestead initialized. As I said earlier, we need homestead.yaml file to configure our sites. It sits in your computer's home directory as a hidden file. If you can't see it, then you need to enable show hidden files. This is how you do in Mac. Next, you need to restart your finder, then you will be able to see all the hidden files. Now drag the .homestead folder to your text editor. Open homestead.yaml file. Next, set the SSH keygen, if you haven't done so, by using this line of code. Now I'm going to create a folder and name it sites inside web folder. This is where all our sites will sit. Let's create a folder called test. Here I'm creating a file index.psp and type some text just so that we can test it out. Now that we have created a test app inside sites, we need to map the folders and sites in homestead.yaml file. Before we see our app in action, we need to run the vagrant op. Let's get inside homestead and see the list of files. Run the vagrant op command to bring up the machine. If you encounter a timeout error like me, simply run vagrant destroy command and run the vagrant op command. Now 
Now try loading our app in the browser to see the outcome. It's not there yet, is it? That's because we need to modify our host file too. Open up a new terminal window and use sudo vim etc host. Add 127.0.0.1 followed by the app domain. Now as we expected we can see our test app working. This is the text that we typed earlier in index.psp file. In the next video I will actually install a fresh copy of Laravel in our sites folder. Thank you.